necessary to succeed in high school, college, and the world beyond. Our core values are diversity, respect, effort, appreciation, motivation, and self-determination. Also known as our dream values. With a 96% attendance average last week, congratulations to Ms. Walden's homeroom and Ms. Vaughn's homeroom for being our top attendance winners from last week. Congratulations. Donuts are headed your way. Congratulations to our top ST Math homeroom, dethroning Xavier University. We have a new winner this week, Miss Aburishi's homeroom, UCSB, with 80% of students meeting their goal of 100 puzzle solved. Congratulations, UCSB. You are the champs for ST Math. Special shout out to our top ST Math performers. We have Johan Johnson with 495 puzzle solved. In second place, we have Heaven Hooks with 361 puzzle solves. In a close third place, we have Demonte Jones with 360 puzzle solves. And in fourth place, we have Maurice Rothschild with 359 puzzle solves. Congratulations. Keep grinding and putting in the hard work. Congratulations to Team 5, Team 6, and Team 8 for having a 90% or more homework completion average last week. Keep grinding and putting in the hard work. Remember, we do homework. This is LHA. Thank you for all those who showed up to support Varsity Football and Varsity Volleyball this school year. Our JV Volleyball team will play Tuesday at Crocker against Wheatley for 5.40 p.m. And our JV Football team will play a playoff game this Wednesday at Green against DTA for 6.30 p.m. Come out and show your support. Congratulations to our Students of the Week for last week. Be sure to tell them congratulations when you see them in the hallway. 50 Eagle Bucks are headed your way. I have a shout out, shout out, shout out to Lamar Mitchell who finished all of first grade ST math. This means that Lamar can choose to remaster first grade skills or move on to a new challenge with solving second grade puzzles. So proud of you, Lamar. Keep leading by example. Thursday team. Thank you to all those who showed up and showed out for mismatch day. Our theme for this Thursday is camouflage day. Dress up in a camouflage shirt, pants, socks, or shoes this Thursday for camouflage day. See you Thursday. Report card conferences will take place November 15th. Please be sure to tell your parents. Stay tuned for more information in next week's video. Congratulations to our top iReady performing homeroom. These homerooms had at least 50% of students reach the goal of completing three iReady lessons last week. Special shout out to Dr. L's homeroom, USC, with 86%, 25 out of 29 students reaching their goal of passing three iReady lessons. Congratulations. 25 Eagle Bucks are headed your way. Congratulations to our top Zern performers. In fifth grade, we have Bryson Thomas with seven lessons passed. In sixth grade, we have Heaven Hunter with, oh my God. Goodness! 21 lessons passed. Okay, Heaven. In seventh grade, we have Christian Walker with six lessons passed. And in eighth grade, we have Jaleel Broomfield with 13 lessons passed. Eagle Bucks are headed your way. You earned it. Our Scholastic Book Fair will take place November 13th through November 17th. Payments will be via Scholastic eWallet. Each student who has perfect attendance from now until November 15th will receive $5 in Scholastic Bucks to spend at the book fair. Scholastic Bucks must be claimed at report card conferences. Keep showing up. 